Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to Yishien, the auto battler deck builder that has consumed my mind and my thoughts. We are going to be checking out the final Cloud Sword Sect character, which is interesting because they are probably my favorite character from, you know, when I've played so far. So it's weird that I save him for last, but we're going to be checking out uh, Lin Xiaoyue here. She's got a cat. What more do you need? But basically, she has a passive that rewards us re-rolling a lot, which is something I like to do. And then she's got a really, really fun uh, card that she gets on, like, her third level up. But I'll be back with the match. All right. But yeah, basically, the character has a passive where if you re-roll all the way down to zero... Cloud Sword Skies are usually decent to start with. What do we have, though? Eh, hold on. If you re-roll down to the final one, then you will kind of get to pick from, uh, or not pick, you get a random cat-related item out of a special pool that only she has access to. I'm kind of tempted to do it, but I really can't change out of this right now. It's not like a good turn one, but if anyone has like a wasted turn of chi generation that doesn't do damage, we might be okay. We might be okay. Okay, well. Or if they didn't slot in. Yeah, they greeted it a bit. It might still work out fine for them because that actually is a pretty good setup if they had a cloud hit. That is. Like, I. This is. As far as running Chiless on turn one, that's. Could be worse. Uh. uh let's think. I. I'm not sure here. Let's go for... Let's go for Formation Master? Let's do Formation Master. Sure. Uh, okay. Get a little bit of that. We actually could get some Sword Intent that we do save up. Four attack, Cloud hit, Defense four. Nah. Alright, now it's getting a little, a little spicy. Sure. Sword Intent, Sword Intent, Defense, uh... So we generate up to five. We get that, that to loop back through. I don't mind it. Okay. Uh, yeah, hands off. I'll take... Hold on. There we go. Woo! Close one. We almost wasted two of our sword intent, but we're fine. All right. So we're going to buff up. This is going to do an extra five. We're going to be doing 16 on this. Loop back through. This does nine damage. Uh, don't mind that. That being said, they're pretty aggro here. So I think I probably die. Yeah, they are. They went. They went. Oh, giga aggro. We need a good, like, multi hit. Oh my god. We need a good multi hit to make use of that. I'll take it. You know what? And I actually. Insta lock. All right, I'm good for five turns. So we get a new card. Sorry for not looking at those, but this character gets this at the, their first level up, which I actually really like. It's basically a multi-hit attack like the other, you know, wind sword, but it also ignores defense. This was a stupid roll. This was a stupid roll. We kind of have to go sword, uh, sword intent now, which is acceptable because this character uses it very well. Uh, but yeah, five attack, so it does two more damage than Wind Sword does, and it ignores defense, and it's a Cloud Sword. So it's kind of just, it's, it's just really nice. It's just really, really nice. All right. If we lose this, I will eat my hat. And I'm not even wearing a hat. So if we get all the way up to seven Sword Intents already, this is going to hurt. And then this is going to be 24 damage. <laughs> oh my god, that is filthy. She, I mean, so this is tempting for multi-hit builds, but we are going to be getting another card that does that anyways. Um, this is good to an extent as well. Sword slash sword, cloud sword riddle. I, I'm not. I haven't used the continuous. 
Chi up, sword intent up. I would rather have that. Exhaust sword intent, get the same amount of chi. No thank you. Okay, now this is getting stupid. This is getting actually dumb. I'm gonna say no to this. Oh my god. Oh my god. We can we can roll a deck this stupid because of this luck. And when I say this oh shoot. Ordering. This needs to be swapped, but uh, it's fine. Oh no, we do nine damage with this. Okay, the question is, are they going to kill me faster? I have a couple defense things in here. There, we're fine. Womp womp. But yeah, this is—it's too. Uh, this is too slow. I can't make it any slower. Unless I run Scut Turtle Formation. That gives us 12 defense. That could be worse. Don't have the chi for that. I'm probably not going to keep Flying Fang Sword, so I'll say sure. So here we go. We used up one of our charges. We have nine total. We get a random card. Absorb, get one max HP and two destiny. Why not? Nothing wrong with that. But yeah, we could put this first to try and stall a little bit. Chi 3. Eh. We all good. We're all good. So the question is basically, how aggro are they? Are they giga aggro kill us before here? Oof. That's gonna hurt. They're stacking up some sword intent. I've got 13 sword intent already. Yeah, we win. That being said, if, if we didn't kill there, that could have been a little bit scary. Sword defense. Sure thing. Sword splash. Oh my god. Uh, the beginning of battle gets sword intent. It's not actually that great. So here's the question. When defeated in battle, if the destiny damage is an even number, have the damage. Or destiny plus 18. What's gonna I think this if I have 97, if I was closer to death, I would go for recuperate, but since I'm closer to full, I think we go for this. Okay. So here's the thing. Well, first of all, should I run this? You seem pretty aggro. Is your average attack more than 12? No. I'm just running it last. I'm running it last. Uh, catnip is really good because if we absorb it, we level up a random card and it prioritizes a card with cat in the name. So we could upgrade this to tier 2 right now which is just 7 damage so we'd be doing 4 more damage or more importantly I'm going to hold off a sec because we are going to rip the game in half in, a, in just mere moments you did not think that much damage was coming out did you holy two times at the beginning of your turn add two chi there's a world where I keep that All right. Um, but yeah, part of me wants to go for this. It would upgrade this into the tier two. But there's another. I don't think there's a way for me to look at the upcoming cards options or the you know. But you may have seen it in the past. It's it's a multi strike move that can hit five times. But if you upgrade it, it hits six times. So. Obviously, in a game of sword intent, that's going to be very, very good. So we would get that. We'd probably drop Flying Fang Sword, move it move it up to here. We would trash this card, actually. We would trash it so that Catnip would hit that other card and upgrade it to seven. Or six strikes instead of five. And I'm basically, like, crossing my fingers that we don't get to the Scut Turtle formation. Pretty darn much. 
We just hit so many golds, though. The thing is, they're, we're going to probably scale out of them late game. I could see us keeping a gold sword defense all the way at the end. All right, your aggro. Here it is. That's the moment of truth. If anybody adds like just a bit of defense, we're gonna start hurting. Um, I can't do this because it would eat the sword intent. Can't really do that either. Another catnip. Okay, well now it's a different story. How many? I have five more stacks of curiosity. So this is weird. If you. If you get five catnips, because here's the thing, look at this. Uh, upgrade two level one cards in your hands or whatever. Uh, so I'm going to do this so that when we get the other card, like I might keep it. I don't know yet. I'm not sure. I'm not sure yet. Oh boy. Are you aggro? Oh boy, are you aggro? The reason I, like, I check in is because I'm like, is this the time where I take away Flying Fang Sword? It's an extra 8, 12, 15. It's an extra 26 damage. It's hard to say no to. It's risky. If they block it, I'm in pain. But who has access to 26 damage worth of block right now? Meh. Not very many people. If they spend the entire time building it up, they could counter it, but nobody's going to be doing that. Nobody's going to uproot their entire build for that. All right, we win. Alternatively, I could get weakened before this, and that would be something. Probably just going for it. So, here's the thing. I want to go for it, but we probably want to wait a little bit. Catnip? No. We want to wait until we have more cards in our hand, because the way this card works, attack times equal to the remaining hand cards. That's these right here. So, I want to wait until I have six cards in my hand. I could have stalled, but then I wouldn't have gotten it as early. The question is, well, first of all, this is better, right? Like, I might as well, I suppose. It attacks three times, but it doesn't ignore defense. Do you have, do you have defense? You don't have defense, then I don't care. Alternatively, hear me out. They ain't living that. They ain't living that. You kidding me? This early? No. Spooky. This doesn't strike me as an aggro build. It's not inherently a bad build or anything. Alright. Here we go. And... Bye-bye health bar. <laughs> oh, it's silly. I might want to keep that. Because I, I, I may pivot. I think we're getting rid of this as much as it is a good card. At the start of your turn, steal two health from the opponent. What the hell? Um. Interesting. All right. Since I hit it, I'll go for it. And then we probably want to move this up. So this is... We need six cards in our hand. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Fine. This is weird, though. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen... But it also, it, it does 15 to them, and it heals me for 15. 
it's a good way god i hate this i hate this but again if they live after this i'm dead anyways right like let's be honest Good. It also goes through their health. Ooh. God, I love that we hit the upgrade on that. And goodbye, health bar. So long, baseball. Adios, baseball. Okay. The hell we do here. Six times, add three defense. Maybe. Homie. Uh... Eh... I'm not, I don't have any cloud sort of stuff for that. One, two, three, four, five, six. So what do we do? I don't know that I, like, without chase. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's fine. Like, I could slot this in. It's not dumb. It's not actively very stupid. We have two more curiosity treats. Scarlet Eye, the Sky Consumer. I think we, I feel like we hit like a Blue Eyes or something. What's the max of this? Five health? Four. That was a lucky hit. It could have hit anything. Unless, maybe it prioritizes it because it was one of my cat cards. Maybe it's not as lucky as it seems. Like, it is nice, but... So we've kind of got like a weird sort of ability to keep ourselves alive. Like we've restored a lot of health. And then we go for the big blast, which does so much more than enough. And thus means it should probably be like moved up. But the more damage we do to them, this is an important thing that um, some people watching don't know. Overkill does matter. The amount of damage that you do to them, the, the difference between their health and your health at the end of combat directly determines how much destiny damage they take. So overkill matters. This is spooky. Okay, well, I need to hit before they hit. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can get rid of two cards. Two times at the end of the turn if you don't chase. This is 14. Six times three. 18. This is, but this is 14 right away. And it upgrades to 21. This is probably better. I'm gonna try I'm trashing two cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm not gonna be able to slot that in. I need to hit my payoff before he hits his payoff. And I will, right? Like. Eh. He can trash more cards than I can. I think I'm fine. But I probably should have moved it up one. Oh, you got, you got, you won the freaking coin flip. You won the coin flip. All right. Oh, he also has chase. I think I might die. I, I might. Yeah, I think I die here. He switched things up a lot. Probably on purpose for um, handling this. Okay, I need to live this, which I think I should be able to. He can only hit three times. I can hit six. Uh, good deal. I can't. I can't slot that in. I can't slot that in. 
That... How does that upgrade? To five. This goes up to four? It does. Nine damage, apply three stacks. It's too expensive. It's a cool card. It's just too expensive. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can get rid of two. This... This hurts. Ooh, smart. Activate. You activate this. Wait, you only have one activation. Oh, you have two activations, but the other activation is super late. Holy chase, this deck is terrifying. Um, man, it might be smash defense. It's scary on a loop through, but you you just I can't go too much later because they're gonna get through their deck twice. If I if I move this back to the end, I feel like they're gonna get to, through their deck twice before I get through mine once. Jeez, man, that is they've got a they've got a really gross deck. Like I, it's their deck is too fast. I can't do anything like it's just way too fast like that is obscene how quick it is all right upgrade first every time you play a cloud sword add a chi it's 10 destiny draw three level two cards with containing the word sword above virtuosa phase get nine rerolls honestly nine rerolls is probably better than anything here Two sword intent at the beginning is not that relevant because I'm going to trash that sword intent. Unless... Mayhaps not. I'm going to go with nine rerolls. I think that that's going to be better for me. Just getting to be... Getting exactly what we need. No. How many hits are we going to get? Can we get like one more hit? There, there's a world where this is a hit, but I'm going to... I would have to completely change everything. Oh, God. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We can trash one card. That sucked. Okay, so who are we fighting? I. Uh, it's fine. This is fine for you. I can't believe how fast this person's deck is. I have no idea how it could beat them. I'd have to get rid of both of these. I'd, I'd get rid of both of these. I'd move everything up for them. I'd have to run Flying Fang Sword as well, I think, probably. I was hoping we would hit a little bit more, but... This is fine. This is falling off. It's it's not going to be that valuable soon. It's also just not that not that good against this person. In specific, oh god. G, what kind of deck are you running? Oh, wait, actually you surprised me. Okay. Here we go. Huh. Oh, thank god. That deck was going to get gross. If they finally ever hit that one card. Uh, don't need any of that. Skip the next one card and then chase. Maybe. There's a real world. Like, if we get that up one more. Eh, who cares on that? It's not that good. It's not that that's bad. I just can't run it. Who am I fighting? Okay. 
I think I have a I think I just have a better payout than you. Yeah, if we make it to the end, we uh we're going to just be so happy to make it to our attack again. So like let's just do that. Mirror formation if we could upgrade it again. Just like to cuz we could skip the next two cards would be skip skip play. So we could run two, and then we could run an attack of seven, uh, seven, nine, nine times six. Like I would not be, I would not be upset to do forty-five damage a second time. Like so, an upgraded mirror formation. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just two. Upgraded mirror formation would be great. I would take that for sure. But I just don't. We can't beat that person. We can't. I really don't think so. It's like, cause I can't be faster than them, and even if I could be faster than them, I couldn't be faster than them in a way that would kill them. They just... The deck is just fundamentally disgusting. Okay. We're going to want to swap this out. All right. Steal a little bit. You're going to do your attack. It hurts. Mine hurts more. <laughs> like, ugh. It's tight, it's tight. Another Scut Turtle. Mirror Formation Me. I don't have Cloud Sword, but like, I'm not running another one of those. Ugh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Can't run this. I need to think, what am I going to do for them? If I if I even live, what do I do for them? I'm happy with a second. And here's the thing. I think I get second regardless because I have 74 health. And I think that there's no way this person beats them. Okay, they're going to hit me with weaken. I need, I need to adjust. So, who goes first? They're going first. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Their sixth turn is this. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. This is better. It's a little bit spookier, but I, I need to not be weakened for my, my big payoff. I don't know if he's changed it. I mean, basically, there's no reason for him to change it unless he thinks I changed mine, right? Or if he found another chase. If he found another chase, I'm screwed. Wait, what? Did you you tweak this? My math is off, or I tweak this, or he tweaked this? Shoot, I'm actually uh, I'm dead here. Well, I'm not dead. I'm losing. Yeah, my math is off. Let's go! I did it! I did it! I did it! I, I changed it right. I changed it right for that. Uh, but still, I there's no way. Ooh, wait. Best I could have expected. What the hell? Okay. Um, something like that into this. Do I live this? I don't know if I live this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Ha ha ha! 
I don't know. I don't think I don't think we can beat this specific deck with the type of deck I have. However, I'm pretty happy nonetheless. They their deck is just too fast. It's so freaking fast. It's absurd. I need that um that one card that's like remove chase. What on earth? They hit they hit so big. All right, this is my move. Nope, I don't get to do it. They hit so hard. And I mean like they're the hits in their deck. Oh my. I Yeah. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. This this can be empty. It doesn't. It's irrelevant. But I will not have played a continuous. Dude. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. All right, GG. It's been real, it's been fun. Theirs is a little bit more strict than mine. It's a little, little, little bit more strict. I can move mine up to do a little bit less damage. Theirs, like, fundamentally has a very specific layout. If I, I don't know. Did they change it? Good God, dude. Good God. What a... Dumb. Okay. I get to do my attack. Yes! <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh... Okay. Uh. Previous sword formation is not happening. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Um. Are they going to adjust? I don't know how they adjust this. I don't know how they adjust it without ruining it. Is there a better place for my defense? Yeah, later. Okay. Man. Did they change anything? They have they have to have changed something, otherwise it's done. But I also technically Oh yeah, they did. They did. But is that gonna Does that make it better for you? Yes, it does. Absolutely it does. That is filthy. That is stupid. They block six hits. They get to block six hits entirely. Isn't that a little dumb? Isn't that a little bit dumb? Uh, well, I obviously can't do anything now. So they go one, two, wait, one, two, three, and they just get to play this twice. And they, they're going 
they're going first. They get to go first because obviously I have to hold on to my cards. I don't, I can't win this. Um... I can't win this. I, yeah. They they have something that literally blocks six attacks for free. It's like, I can't do anything about that. Obviously. They just cycle through their entire deck before I get to play mine. I don't know. This This obviously, this isn't even worth having here at this point, but it's just like, look at this. The next time, the next six times you lose defense, get that defense back. Good God. That is, this is so gross, this deck. I can't be mad. I can't be mad. I, I was able to take them down one, but yeah, it's just literally a, a one card hard counter to my deck. So I'll take a second and I'll take it Take it happy. I'm, I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it. Couldn't have done much better considering the card they had. Uh, but alas, alas, that is that. That's going to do it here for today. Thank you for watching. Check out the channel for indies and more every single day. If you want more Yi Xian, you got to let me know in the form of a comment down below. Likes and comments go a long way to help things out. Thank you, thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye.